Officers are still here on the 600 block of Noble Road. They are doing crash reconstruction right now because police say this is where that chase ended in a crash and the vehicle that they're surrounding right now appears to be one of the vehicles that was involved, but the district attorney's office didn't specify exactly which vehicles. So let's show some video from this scene earlier today. The DA's office says this all started around one o'clock this afternoon on Maple Shade Road as sheriff's deputies were trying to serve a felony warrant on a 26 year old man. They say that that man somehow escaped deputies, got into a vehicle and started driving towards the sheriff's deputies who the DA believes were also in their vehicle. That prompted one of those deputies to fire at least one shot. The DA says he may have fired more. Now, no one was hit, no one was hurt, but the chase then continued for about four miles on 896 and again ended here. It was a low speed chase, according to the DA's office, and it ended here on the 600 block of Noble Road. And coming back out here alive, we do have some looks like tow trucks are coming out here to pick up these vehicles right now, but police were able to arrest the man who was driving. Again, it was a 26 year old man from Gap. Police didn't say what that warrant he was wanted for was for. Here comes those tow trucks by us now of uh, the truck here in the front, that Chevy truck that the tow truck is driving towards. We do believe that that was the sheriff's deputy vehicle because earlier you could see that that truck does have flashing lights on it. Again, no one hurt here, but a 27 year old man arrested and his female passenger was also taken into custody. But the DA's office says right now they don't even know if she did anything wrong. We'll be